Hey Cancers, welcome to Vivid Vibration. My name is Christina. I hope that y'all are doing well. Okay, so we have Anima Mundi. Oops, upside down. Anima Mundi, the Siren, the Mask, the King and the Queen, the Thread and Heart. <laughs> Cancers. Um, God, where to start? I guess I want to start with Anima Mundi. Um, because this really just feels like that whole, in all things be all things, right? I mean, Anima Mundi is the idea that like everything is interconnected and everything happens with a reason. And, you know, I was talking to, to somebody last night and we were just kind of talking about, you know, like the idea of like surrendering to the universe and like, what does that like look like? And what does that feel like? You know, like it, when you say it and you know, like you can, you can, postulate it in a way that sounds a lot better than the reality of what it was you know or what it is um and I feel like there's just kind of this this means of of understanding like divine timing and placement and you know just like and like following your intuition and like what does that look like um because it, it always affects more than just us right you know like like our lives our lives come together you know with purpose and intent i mean i believe i know not everyone believes that but um i i, I think i just have always believed that since i was a little girl and <laughs> it's a belief that like come hell and high water i haven't been able to get rid of um but Anyways, I don't know. I just Sharon, <laughs> the siren in the mask. I mean, it really is just kind of like this idea of like the the call to really pull off the mask. I mean, right? It's just that idea again of like everything happening with a reason, everything like and like trusting in the process because I think that we have a difficult time trusting in any any process because um, you know that isn't I think like a prefabricated, <laughs> laid out, mandated process. Um, you know, which is oftentimes like what that feels like, you know, it's just like going through the, going through the motions when you know that like the motions aren't leading you down the path that you want to go down. Um, and, and being called in a direction that, that no longer requires that, like that mask. Um, you know, the thread in the heart. I love this one cause it's got the little like canoe inside the nest. So it's like the idea of, um, you know, the home is where the heart is and I feel like again with the siren and the thread there's just this idea of like this pull this this connection you know and it's like I'm I know that I'm connected to this if if nothing else I'm connected to this direction you know what I mean like of, of the direction of my heart the direction that I feel pulled to go uh, and I think that it you know it results in um you know just a I don't want to say kingdom, you know, but like kingdom sounds like way more like a, like a completely different visualization than like what it is that I actually see in my mind. But, you know, I mean, the, the, the idea of the kingdom is that there's, there's plenty, right? There, you know, you've got an entire community that's involved in, in a kingdom. Um, and I feel like you are, I think when you're removing the mask, when you're answering this call to remove the mask and move in the direction that that like calls to you that you feel connected to that's when you know like you start to see everything fall perfectly into place you know like the timing of it all the you know like like the way that it plays out plays out in a way where you're like i can't even question the like whether or not this was the right thing to do it's so clearly the right thing to do <laughs> i love it <laughs> okay Seven of Wands, Nine of Pentacles, and Page of Swords. So, I mean, this is just, again, that idea of, like, pulling yourself up out of this, 
um, you know, stage in life or the cycle in life, it's kind of seeing the, like the light at the end of the tunnel, you know, like the, through the thicket of the forest, like you made it out to the other side. Um, and you know, the page of, of swords is usually like a, like a commitment card. So, you know, starting a new job, um, you know, like, or just like committing yourself to this new beginning, you know, like committing yourself to taking off the mask and just like embodying like the fullness of who you are. Um, you know, because I feel like, again, it's that idea of like, like attracts like, and if you stand in your power, you will attract people who stand in their power too, you know, and like, that's what you want. Like, that's what you want around you. You want around people, you want to be around people who stand in their power. The Three of Cups, the Fortune Fairy, and the Lovers. Mm, love this. I mean, for a lot of my cancers, you know, you're you're looking at like a relationship or, um, you know, like a renewal of a relationship. You know, like I, I've had like so many of my cancer friends are married, <laughs> but you know, like if if you're if you're married and you know, then it's just kind of like that, you know, that like renewal of your relationship, that deepening of your relationship. If it's something new, then I feel like you are, you're just, ex I feel like it's almost this like, like, like the universe has just been waiting on you to do it. You know, like you keep saying what you want, but you're not doing anything to go for it. And I feel like when you, when you make this decision to really like answer the call of like who you are rather than you know like carrying on the facade of who it is that you're supposed to be that's when everything just lines up for you and it and it feels as though you know like the fortune fairy has you know like found favor with you <laughs> dig <laughs> okay can't say nine of cups wish fulfillment <laughs> this is such a lovely like beautiful read cancer i'm so pleased i mean it just oh, i'm sorry the ten of cups happy life emotional fulfillment satisfaction i feel like it's just that like that removal of the mask and the and the knowing of all the reasons that like the mask mask existed and all the ways that you know like growing up my mom would always say well there's always got to be a silver lining try and find the silver lining you know like if I ever was upset about anything she was like there are people in the world who have it worse than you <laughs> she's kind of a bitch but it's true you know like there everybody has it worse and and not everybody a lot of people have it worse you know a lot of people have it better too but it's kind of like I don't know like I think of like when you think about who your audience is and and why is that your audience and what is your goal in your conversation with that audience like everybody everybody's going to have different life experiences because they're going to have different groups of people to speak to you know what I mean and so I feel like there's just this idea of instead of trying to reach an audience that's not your audience like or be a part of a community that's like very clearly not your community you know what I mean you're just like but you're like these are the people I'm around so these are the people that I have to be with you know but like removing that entirely and finding that you in making your life decisions draw people who are making the same life decisions <laughs> And ain't that the way it's supposed to be? <laughs> okay, the womb. Oh, I love. It's safe. You feel safe. You feel safe for... I almost want to say, like, the idea of, like, getting comfortable, right? Like, like anytime you try anything new, like, if you 
like you have to kind of like get your like your sea legs if you will um and i feel like there's just this idea of like safely acquiring your sea legs as you swim into your power quite possibly with a with a with a lover if not a lover it could be you know like a friend like somebody who just like compliments you really well and you feel like you can be a part of a team with this person you know and you love them very dearly and you're like oh, family i missed <laughs> you know um people people but okay cancers well i hope this resonates with y'all thank you so much for hanging out with me and i will see y'all again soon bye